look at the damage to the forks and even the brakes absolute nasty look at that and all just because of a cheap lazy way of filling holes in the road some more new roads more new roads look be lovely living out here wouldn't it hey anyway Monday morning the first installment to my weekly workouts so I try and up my game a bit and uh, still need to lose some bloody weight so I'm gonna start logging my workouts and today I meant to get up early but I didn't sleep very well what is it now 10 30 and I've been out for about an hour so I was hoping to get out before it got too warm to be fair but I was awake at seven but I couldn't get out of bed I was I was a bit knackered but yeah so Monday and um, we're off to the canal later on, around lunchtime-ish. Probably when I get back. Yeah, so we're just gonna go and do a bit of Bodhi Bodhi. We've got Irene, got the mother-in-law here, so. Uh, but yeah, I'm working tomorrow, Wednesday and Thursday. Um, and just taking a bit of a Skyview one today, which is fine, because I'll keep it from the boss, he won't know. I'll catch you in a bit. Go, had a puncture if you didn't guess that by now blimey anyway I'm a mess ah oh, today's been a bit riddled with roadworks a few hills I didn't know about and finally a puncture I'm gonna go for a cup of coffee 22 and a half miles it's too warm it's too warm a couple of road closures and a puncture uh, I was going to do 30, but anyway, I'll try again tomorrow. Working tomorrow, but hoping to get out in the afternoon if it's not too hot. Hello, lovely people. Look, Hartley Westfall. Nice. I know I'm wearing the same shirt as yesterday. I didn't really think about it when I grabbed the shirt and put it on. So it is Tuesday, and I'm afraid I'm going to do about 13 miles. I went the long way round to Danes Hill. Because I knew I'd be knackered when I got there. But 30 miles is better than nothing. Today has just been a bit tiring. The heat, the chat, it's just wiped me out. So the 30 miles is better than nothing. Alright? So we'll see what Wednesday we can do on Wednesday. Hold on. They graveled the roads, look. I've got to do a bit of bit of off-roading to save the tyres something's stuck I'll we'll catch you in a minute
Looks like someone got up early this morning. And the only reason why I got up so early was because I wanted to feel the cold. <laughs> it is chilly, but I'm loving it. Hey, after all this bloody heat, I'm cold. Thank God for that. Morning people. As you can tell, I'm in a different top, so it must be a different day. Today's training effort was getting out of bed at 20 past five. That was my effort today. I just had to get out in the cold. So, uh, yeah, that was that really. And here I am. Hoping to do about 20 mile. I've got a really busy day. I'm up in, uh, I'm up in London today. So Lewisham, Streatham and Caterham. So I won't be home till late. So I thought I'd give my metabolism a kickstart this morning. And there you go. So I might even have time to stop for a coffee counterintuitive but you've got to give yourself something to go by i'll catch you in a bit we're just over 24 miles this morning oh what a beautiful morning pity i can't get up that time of day every day it'll kill me today's gonna to be a tiring one but anyway there's my efforts I was trying to do some efforts this week but with the way that the weather's been it's just been a bit hard going whatever to be honest with you so anyway but another 24 miles in the bag and i've still got the whole of the day to go and a little bit of gravel that use a shite uh. <laughs> oh. Chow, that was nearly a chow over those little bumps so here we are here we are again out for a little while with Jamie, he's a bit fitter than me because uh, I've been a bit lazy. We covered, we covered from a little operation, but good to be back out on the bike for a little ride with him. As usual, he's putting it into me one of his flat rides, as you know. I've got a wobbly back wheel due to the excessive weight that's pounding <laughs> down. <laughs> uh, I should have got it fixed, but I'm, I'm bothered. Anyway, we're just out for a little ride. And this, I think this is Jamie's uh, first riding vlog video for a while. I've seen some others that he's done. But I'll hand you over to the champ himself. <laughs> the champ. <laughs> the champ. <laughs> it's now Monday, people. So I didn't get much done last week. So, uh, but the day is a bit more glorious than it has been over the weekend. So all good there, and uh, yeah, so we're out, only for about 20, I didn't want to put it into the old boy too much. It's true, I'm due to go away, due to go away for a month, again, to recoup, come back all bronze, stealth like Adonis figure that I am, <laughs> not, Stiff. not. He's still are you supposed to do how dangerous is this for a cyclist but then putting this crap down there
Look at the state of the wheels, tyres. Look. Look at the state of them. Look. Scratching their way up through the fork. Look at the rear wheel. And that's just coming up one road. Look, there's another one up there. They've probably done a few more. So every every two bloody every 30 seconds we've got to stop and clear the tires off. It's an absolute joke. Look at the state of the hands, man. So not only is it damaging my tires, it's actually damaging the bloody frame as well. Look at the state of it. Poor old Simon's having a right old mare. Look at it. This people is the fourth time I've stopped in less than bloody 300 yards. Got the state of it. Car! Put my shoes on. I'm putting my shoes on, I'm gonna fing walk it. They've done all the way along this road, it's gonna be an absolute nightmare. Wingy Simon of the week. Yeah, Wingy Simon. He's just taken me up this road where they've just resurfaced it, and we've both had to stop. He, he, he's taken me up this road. It's a road we go up all the time. The stones are stuck to my tyres. It's done, it's done a groove in my front tyre where there's a stone stuck in the top part of the fault cage, and we haven't been able to ride for about. 200 yards so now it's ruined what was quite a nice ride so he owes me a thousand pounds for all the damage simon's whinging of the week you missed him didn't you <laughs> just had a couple of coffees actually literally a couple of coffees each times two a couple so of coffees actually, each times two. We've actually spent more time drinking coffee than we did help the bike. <laughs> <laughs> Needed to catch up. And our bikes are ruined from our little excursion off on the uh, on the cheap and lazy patching up of roads. Catch you in a bit. Finished. Done dilly dusted. Just over 21 and a half, 22 feels, miles. Feels like 50. Yeah. Cause I'm old. And hopefully, goodbye from him. And goodbye from him. Hopefully you enjoyed some of the other bits. And uh, yeah, look forward to some imminent reviews of the bars and the scribe wheels. Lots of love people see you on the road very soon. Mind the gravel. It's just a lazy way of repairing roads. Lazy. <laughs>